So reference class forecasting is a forecasting method, as the name says, uh, that is using a reference class of past similar projects to predict the project that you are now planning to do. So it's forecasting methodology that instead of using the kind of judgment and modeling that forecasters usually do and which often results in optimism bias, is using you no know, hard facts. It's a forecasting method that includes everything that happened to previous projects, including the famous unknown unknowns. And this is the thing that's the most is that they actually with reference class forecast and get a methodology with which they can finally tackle uh, the famous unknown unknown, which many people think are impossible to forecast, but they're not, I'm sure you can see, because if you include everything that happened to the projects in the reference class, that includes the unknown unknown. And it doesn't matter how it happened. It doesn't matter whether it was cognitive bias, whether it was political bias or whatever type of bias made the forecast go off. Whatever it was, it's included. And that means that you actually have that as part of your forecast when you're doing a reference class forecast. And which is why, and this is very well documented, you don't have to believe me, there are lots of independent studies that document this, that reference class forecasting is the most accurate forecasting methodology that exists in the world today.